Huh? Uh, that's right, you know. Marva, get over here. Mount Rushmore, South Dakota. I want to come over there and read it. The best part of Mount Marishmore. Turn it on. Oh, well, I didn't know.
This is Sioux Falls. <coughs> you got me? What's the name of this place? Clear Lake. Clear Lake? Yeah. Minnesota? Okay. Just before we get into La Crosse, Mississippi River. 12 miles from the Mississippi River. That's the Mississippi River you can see down below there. 12 miles away. Galesville, Wisconsin. Pretty farms here in Galesville, Wisconsin. This is in Wisconsin, near the Mississippi River. A scenic look near Leclure. A lot of beautiful farming to this country. A lot of forests.
This park is made by the Nielsen Brothers. Just off the tip, upper tip of Lake Michigan. The north end of Lake Michigan. 50 degrees breeze. Quite cool. It's really a big lake. Got a lot of water. This is at North Bay, Canada. This is near Sharon, Vermont, northern part of Vermont. This is in Vermont. Joseph Smith's birthplace. Marva getting pretty deep.
you here on a mission? Or? Yes. Uh, yeah, we we're been here about eight months, and we leave mm -hmm. the first of November and go over to Little Branch in Maine and spend the rest of the mission over there. Good old day getting out of Canada. <laughs> yeah. Think, did you want to go on a tour while you're here? Joseph Smith Monument in Vermont. Born Sharon, and most of it's in Royalton. And the only reason it said Sharon is because it says he's born in the East Rim of Cabin. So that's why they picked it. He farmed his father farmed 100 acres here in the summer and taught school in the village in the winter. And, uh, the old Turnpike Road here is there, and there's a stone bridge across the creek down there that's still there that was there in 1805. Okay. We don't really know, we're guessing because maybe because Joe Smith Sr. was the first patriarch of church, so they might have called it that. We don't really know. It may not have any reason to call it. Box 7, Livingston, New Jersey, 07039. You think this is the only way to follow me? What's the answer? When the Eagles said they must live with our defense, but the Saints are unbelievably undefeated. I wish I had a television. Tom Berenger, Charlie Sheen, and Corbin Burnson. Believe you've been playing it. But now, whether he gets to the Supreme Court or whether he stays where he is, he wants his life back. That's what's important. I haven't been doing it. This is in Hatfield, Massachusetts. Hatfield, Massachusetts. Plymouth Rock, this is the Mayflower. Mayflower in Plymouth Rock.
There's a car parked at Plymouth Rock. Marva trying to get in the bathroom at Plymouth Rock. This is the Mayflower at Plymouth Rock. Move back that way a bit. Where are you going? Go back. Go back. Over this way. Okay. Marva standing in front of the Mayflower. Just out of Deerfield, Massachusetts. Deerfield, Massachusetts.
out of Deerfield, Massachusetts. Just a ways before we get to Jeff's parents' place in Connecticut. This is the pike out of Boston. This is Jeff Bremer's parents' home in Connecticut. Jeff Bremer's parents' home. They got a swimming pool there, and they got some pheasant houses. They raise pheasants. Big, beautiful lawn. Beautiful country here, a lot of trees. Okay, what do you have to say? Hi, Jeff. Well, they're here. <laughs> Jeff, these are your parents. <laughs> in case surprise, you didn't know. Surprise, you haven't seen us in so long. <laughs> How long has it been? It's a year ago Christmas. Oh. I'm here in Connecticut, believe it or not. <laughs> When those old Idahoans. <laughs> this beautiful place you have here is I like this country. Well, I took some pretty good pictures, but you know I can't see I don't know if that's gonna get it or not. That pointed right towards you? Oh, there. Yeah. That's good. That should do it. Your hair's sticking out. Your hair's sticking out. So you look like... She says I've got some hair. That's a compliment. <laughs> you look Can like you see us? <laughs> Hopefully, huh? Well, I guess it's getting us. I don't know. Pick up things you don't really want to pick up sometimes, huh? going.
What's that up there? Hey, it must be Halloween. I see some ghosts. Hey, what, what is your name? Huh? What's your name? Tell me your name. <laughs> is your name? <laughs> tell him huh? Rock and Rod. Uh, he's going to show that to Jeffy. He's going to send one I'm going to show Jeff. this to Jeffy. We'll send it to Jeff them. Rock and Rod. <laughs> 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 Don't take me. Don't take me. Can I get right in front of me? Yeah. Oh, oh, it's over, Grandpa. Me. Can you get them all? Yeah, he can move around. <laughs> yeah. yeah, he can move it all around. <laughs> <laughs> Who's that good looking girl there? Huh? Who's that? <laughs> Say hi, Uncle Jeff. <laughs> Come on, we're going to send this to them. They can hear what you say. Every movement and everything you say will be on there. Hi, Jay-Z. 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 Hi, Oops. But I can't get you. Wave hi. Brother, take your seat. Wave hi. Say hi to Uncle Jeff. Hi, 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 Uncle Jeff. Hi
The Golden Place, the Book of Mormon. South America are descendants of a great people who occupied this hemisphere many centuries before Columbus. Evidence of their greatness, the splendor of their cities, and the brilliance and variety of their cultures has been discovered in rich abundance. But as yet, the world's greatest scholars are still largely baffled by their written languages and the secrets of who they were and from whence they came. A fragmentary knowledge of these ancients survives in the traditions told and retold among their descendants. One of the most significant of these survivals is the legend of the great white god who came to the Americas nearly 2,000 years ago and who testified that one day he would return. A chapter from English history tells how Captain James Cook of the British Admiralty discovered the legend of the great white god for himself the day he landed in the Hawaiian Islands. When the natives learned that a white man had arrived, they sent out the glad news. Hill Kamara. This is where they hold the pageant. Who is that? Can you tell it? I don't know who it is. I'm going to go get dry. I don't know if it's going to pick it up or not. It's dark. No, it's too. His home when he received the plates where he lived when he received the plates okay go ahead picture of Garth and mama Marva Joseph Smith's home where he lived at the sacred grove There's some big trees here right by his home. Maple trees. Did you make it? Yep, made it. Joseph Smith's home in Palmyra. Whose room is this? Samuel, William, and Don Carlos. Daniel Williams and Don Carlos. Samuel was hmm. the first missionary for the church. He took some the first missionaries of the church. And he 
walked about 50 miles down to Livonia. So it wasn't a total loss. Joseph Smith's bedroom. This is how they put the glass and plaster on the wall. Those original panes made in the house. Isn't that a project? Look at the interesting flooring in there. You'll notice the boards are not even in width. They're wide and taper in the shape of the trees they cut them from. Those are all hung in grooved floors, and so that meant they had to be patient and fit those carefully together. Mm -hmm. Would have shared this room too, but he died before the house was finished. You can see some of the lath work on the wall here, still in place. No. Um, if you look up at the ceiling, you'll see a lot of the original. Did Harm get married before Joseph? Yes, he did. Just after that, Joseph got married, got a new roommate, brought him a man. Well, no. His first wife was Jerusha Arden. And I remember there was Mary Fielding Smith later. So I think Jerusha died. Plus, they had visitors. But this, the church, instead of putting a big table here, with the benches or table chairs, and they decided to put a display and show a little bit about life on the farm back in the days when the Smiths lived here. Flax plant, one of the crops they used to raise. And you can see the fiber that makes the linen that they used to wear. What, what, what kind? What was that? This is flax. Flax. And this flax? is the linen that comes from it. Oh. One of the natural hmm. fibers, like linen. It was raised right here then. They raised it on the farm. One of their family, just the fibers. This is called a toe. You heard of a toe-headed kid? Yeah. T-O-W? Well, that's where it came from. And I've also, <laughs> I've also heard them say, don't give me any flack. <laughs> and wash and dry and smooth it around this thing called put on loops and woven into fabric. But in order to find out how much thread they had, they measured it. And this old piece is called a quick reel. This part's called a wheel. These used to fit in there and turn. And this turn is they added the thread and Here's where they kept their pots and pans and everything for the kitchen. And the churns and the bowl. And they had the screw to make holes in the boards when they made their homes. and white here, Ma. This is pretty. Hmm. Dad taking picture of United States from Canada. How exciting. This is, this is the Erie River in the Canadian side going to to the falls. What kind of falls? Niagara, Niagara Falls. In Niagara. <laughs> okay, pull forward and I'll get a picture of the bridge up there. 
Good. That one up there. Look up about that car and turn like this. Turn that way, turn around a bit. Look at there. That's the International Railroad Bridge between the United States and Canada. Going over Erie River out of the Lake Erie. There's puro agua, mano, aquí hay mucha agua. Mama ordered me to take it out of the car, not lose so much time getting out. Well, number one, this, son, that, nuts. That's the United States on the other side of the river from Canada. Or the River Erie. And that's the city of Buffalo over there. And that ain't no Buffalo. Go forward, let's go. I can bring that falls right up to me where it's getting me wet. This is Niagara Falls from the Canadian side. Looking at the U.S. side. Looking at the U.S. side. That's American water falling over there coming to Canada. Dad, look. See the stairway down there? So you can walk down there? Yeah, they got a stairway going down that other side there. So you can walk down to where the water is. You walk right down underneath the falls. Oh, there's a lot of mist going there. Dad, you can walk behind the falls. Behind the water. They say it makes your hair curly if you go back there. I think I'll go back there. Yeah. Picture that bridge going across. There's a bridge going over. Big, pretty bridge. A lot of water. picture of the boat while it was dead. Get can, that pipe in the way. Well, I can bring that up so close to I can even hear him talking. Get that pipe in the way? Sounds like they're speaking French. Looks to me like that pipe. Oh, well, somebody pet, huh? No, you take the picture. Sounds to me like they're speaking Indian. Why don't you get a hold of the pipe? Yeah. Chat now, let me get that. Here's the big fall. A lot of mist. Garth? Garth? What? Get mom and stand up here and let's get a picture of you. Boy, well, you want us to stand on this pipe up here? Yeah. We're going to go down the end, Dad. 
Yeah. That, I see rabbit ears. Why? That's mom in front of the Niagara Falls. Take a picture of the castle. Picture of the castle up here just by Niagara Falls. Maybe like this. Great big high place for you to go up in to be able to see the whole country. Way up there, several hundred feet high. People are from Jordan. Yep. Standing by Niagara Falls. Yep. Another big high place that you can see all over the country. This is on the Canadian side, Niagara Falls. And there's a big Sheraton Hotel. Get a picture of a castle over there, right on the falls, huh? Gibbs. I guess you'll put something in this. There goes Mom and Garth over to the castle. Hope I can get them. Going up in the castle there. Picture from the cover on, I didn't get nothing. Sheraton Hotel. Here's the Minolta. Niagara Falls in Canada. Canadian flag and American flag. Look this falls over there. Hold this straight. Hold that straight. You hold it straight? Yeah. 
Get the buildings over there too in front of the falls. Yeah, I am. Now you're actually running the other way. Picture of Dad without his hat. You got a, blocking you got the falls. High, you? You no, I've got you. I got it back now. What are you looking? A key? Yeah. What? That's a. That's a pretty picture. Uh, Canadian side of the falls, sitting up on top of a cliff. Saying Minolta Tower. It's a tall dude, let me move it out so you can see how tall it is. Check that out, huh? Got an inclined railway there. Where is it, dude? There it is, right next to it. Can you? It's right next to the tower. See the car just sitting there? There it is. Real long one there, probably about 200 foot. There's mom. Those two girls think I'm taking a picture of them, don't they? See the boat. The boat goes right up underneath the, right up to the edge of the falls. All the people on them are wearing their rain slickers. I guess they must be allergic to water or something. That's quite a ways down there. Then you put it out to the... That's about normal now, so you can see how far away that is. Right? Long way down there. Good jump. We got a restaurant above where we park. Back of mom's head, back of dad's head. Oh, look at that shine. My goodness. Uh oh, he's getting cozy. Hello, what? Mom and dad trying to stand in front of the tire. They want me to get all of it in there, so. It's zooming sucker back. A bunch of fat people walking by. Hey, there we go. Big old tower up there behind. Got it, Dad. We'll bring the tower in so you can see that. Where you can go way up there. It's got a little car that runs up the side of it. You can see it up there. See the car going up the side of it? Well, wouldn't that be fun? Okay. This is Buffalo, New York. Garth driving 80 miles an hour while I'm taking the pictures. Oh, we're only going 50. Looks like we went inside. When we get down here, you'll have to get the uh, stadium. Here's where they play ball. This is the stadium. Which stadium is it? Bison. Uh, See it? Get the that The Bisons. This is the Bison Stadium, right through the window. <laughs> This is the car that we're going to head into. This is a historical Johnson farm, the place where the Prophet Joe Smith and Hiram were tar and feathered. Eighteen twenty-eight. There comes a couple of Johnsons, Marva Taylor and Garth Taylor.
they got some orchards here too pretty orchards even got an oil well here the only oil well in the country you see it part pumping oil down there Johnson home. And the only thing that we know are original here in the home. Everything is probably from about that period of time. But the, all the mammals, all the mammals here, and that little herd rack right there, are the only thing that we know is original here in the home. When, when Wilford Wood bought the home back for the church, the Monroe lived here until probably about 1973. And then they went to the attic and they found all the mammals and they found, they found that little herd rack. Now, when you look at the fireplaces when you go through here, uh, they're not their fireplaces uh, stimulate for the other fireplaces for here in the home. Now, when Elsa was here, and I tell you, now what That's really made this one unique here, place. now John built a chimney right directly over this. He could build a fire on it in the evening, on the inside of it, keep it going all night long. Mm -hmm. In the morning, you take out the... Fifteen revelations here. In fact, if you counted the Doctrine and Covenants, there's 16. Mm -hmm. And what happened on the 78th section of the Doctrine and Covenants, where the prophet left the home here, and he went to Kirtland, he had that one in a buggy. Oh, okay. This was the study. This was, his, this was the prophet's library. This was the prophet's study. Uh-huh. When he gets through camcord, they're all going this so right here is the uh, apple orchard Johnson Farm. This is their cold storage for their apples. And the old boy there driving a forklift. Hope you can see that. And right down the hill, it's kind of hard for me to see. See here because the sun's so shining bright. I hope the camera can pick it up. But that right down there is the. Uh, oil well for the farm and it does produce right now it's not running but it does produce oil and there's another one somewhere on the farm so there are churches into oil wells okay maybe I can see it better now a little while ago I couldn't see it but that's the oil well for the the church's oil well on the John Johnson farm Hiram Ohio Garth in the truck that he drives doing his book work this is in Ohio, the church welfare archer. Okay, okay, you're being taken now. Hi, everybody. Wished you were here. Yep. Wished Ooh, you were here, too. Please excuse J.G.'s hand. He's 19. Hi, J.G. Uh, here's, here's the other ones. We're saying hi. They ain't seen me yet. They're going to wait till they come over here. There's a lot of fun in it. Oh, man. Yeah. This is a Jake is good pictures. Yeah. What do you say, Gigi? Huh? What do you say? Uh, I say, what's up? Huh? What do you say? What's up? What's up? What's up? What's up? What's up? Picture of you. Get a picture of us doing something, not just sitting here saying nothing. Wow, let me get my hair. The room this dark and it'll get it. No, we're going to take pictures. Yeah. 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 Yeah.
This is a dad load the trunk of the car. Garth and Joyce's house. Look at him working hard. Cussing up a storm. Can't get all that junk in there. <laughs> this is my neighborhood, isn't it? Fine. Look at the look at how close those houses are together. Isn't that neat? One good fire and you got a whole new town that way. I <laughs> uh, better show you the back of my house there. It's just like hillbilly heaven, isn't it? Look at that. <laughs> Check it out. Two old chairs back there on the back porch to sit on and barbecue grill. Three level house, big old hillbilly porch. Look at the house next door. Isn't that a beautiful house? Yeah, that's great. Nothing like a little homemade siding there. Yeah, let's Here, I come again. Here comes Joyce carrying stuff out the car. She's got a whole arm load. Look at that. Yeah. <laughs> Today I'm gonna dye my hair too. Yeah. That's the trash bin next door. They're kind of remodeling the inside of their house. I want to show you the how close these how I am to the neighbors on this one side. That's the one that's the farthest away. Pretty close, isn't it? All right, now I'm gonna walk around to the front. Okay, now we're around the front of the house. Kinda trying to get it out far enough. Can't get back far enough. You can see the whole dang house at one time, hardly. You got the uh, porch down there. Can't see it from here, but there's a real nice oak porch swing on there. Two stories, and you can see there's an attic above it. That right up there, two windows there in the middle are JG's bedroom. One window off to the right, that's mine and Joyce's house next door. Move over and let you see how much room there is on this side. Now you can see that fence, right? The neighbor's fence runs right up to the side of our house. We don't have any property on that side of the house. You see my big old pear tree there in the front yard. I'll move up here and there we go up the front porch. Shake you guys up a little bit. There's the porch swing. Say. Things made out of oak slats there. Real nice. I took and finished that myself. And I don't sound proud, do I? Well, I will whirl you around a little bit. Let you see the neighbor's house. See how close they are together? It's great. Now I'll take you around and let you see some of the inside of the house. Some of the inside of the house here. Now, I want you to understand now that but Mom and Dad have been here for a couple of days, so everything's a mess. Usually it's in perfect order. Mom and Dad, they're arguing about where to put everything in the car. How come it's flashing E on this thing? Is that okay? Oh, the battery's running down. Battery's running down. Yeah. Well, we don't care. There's a refrigerator. Ho oh, ho. Get me excited, man. A refrigerator. You kidding me? I guess we're not going to do very good because the battery's going dead. Dad, you got another battery for it? Yeah. You better get it out. Oh, let me show you our dining room. That was our kitchen. Man, you can't see much. Can't get it small enough to see everything, but... Oh, brother, back. There's our, uh, it's run all the way back, Dad. There's our picnic table in there that's made out of oak. Amish made that. Top, and I put it together. Wow, great. This is our TV rooms. Check it out. Mattress there. Brought that out for Grandpa to lay on while he watched TV. He looked like he was kind of tired. And TV. These big old French doors we got. And that there goes into the in the front room there. But we got somebody living in there. So can't go in there. This is the library. And Joyce's big old desk. With her computer she won't let anybody use. Right in there, that door, behind that door is a little bathroom, and mom's in there, so I guess you don't want to see that. 
that hole in the ceiling. We got one of those. Gotta have one of those. Man, this is our stairway. Well, I think our batteries quit. I better stop now. Stay free out in the road playing football with Brady. Brady down the road. It's JC. Can you say hi, JC? Say hi. Guess who? A. This is our Liz. house. B. Looking at the front porch, Stacy. C. Jeffrey. Let's talk Let's get a little D. closer to JC here. JC. Just swatted at Jeff. Yeah. Comes Brady. Brady, say hi. Hi. Hey, guess what? My score was <laughs> zero to thirteen. We won. I made four scores. I had. Play tight end. You're supposed to do a tour, kind of like Garth did. There's our garbage can. It's a pretty exciting part of our area, of our yard. I'm tight end. Walking can on I the side of the house, going into football. the backyard. Dad, can I see something? There's our swing set where JC and Dylan play most of the time during the day. Jeffrey just boomed his ball in the neighbor's yard. <laughs> We have some pretty, pretty tall trees in the back of our yard. Dad. 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 Daddy. Here's our back of our house. Sliding glass doors get in and out. Air conditioner. You gotta have one of those in Oklahoma. Jeffrey, see if he can get over that fence without getting caught. Here's Brady with his newest pet. Yep, yeah, or a grass snake. Hey, hold still. <laughs> Bring him over here. That's good, right there. I'll zoom in on him. There he is. <laughs> Put him back in there. There's Jacy swinging her doll. Hi. Oh, Jeff. Dad, can, 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 can I put him back in there? Can I His name's Grassy. This is down, looking down our street at our neighbor's house. It's hey, hey. A real nice neighborhood. Hey, Dad, can you see me? Yes. Um, Jeffrey's team, his tackle football team, stinks, and soccer team, our soccer team is cool, Looking the other dude. way down the street. He's stealing. It's getting real big. Jeffrey, why don't you pick him up? <coughs> can, can I take yeah. some pictures? Who made your Halloween? Hi. Um, who made hey, Dylan. 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 There's Liz and her new glasses. Hi. What do you think? Mommy. Let's get a close up and see what we think of these new glasses here. <laughs> There's Brady trying to make some brownie points for later on today. Yep. Daisy, we don't listen to her. This is typical Why background. Your <laughs> Small house tour here, going to our kitchen. Yeah. We're kind of nervous. 
sink, the stove, oven. This is looking out our sliding glass doors into our backyard. Hey, yo. This room, that's their trophies that they got from these baseball and mine. jogging and playing with Derby. Derby. Let's go get them. Yeah. Everybody sit behind me. Everybody sit behind me. Yeah. Hi, Jeff. Hey everybody. Okay, press it. Turn it off now. That's enough. Okay, this is our car. This is our car. See our refrigerator? Let go. You're not even pushing the button. Turn it off. You done? Yep. Okay, there's Jeff. Take a good look at him with his mustache. He's going to shave it off soon and you'll never see it again. <laughs> There's a fly on the thing. Come here, Brady. Come out of the way, please. There's a fly there. Okay. Okay, how do you turn it off? Press the button again. What? Well, now, Brady, take a picture or something. Okay. okay. Hi, Grandma. Turn it off. There. Now, now it's take, on. No, you have to take your thumb off now. Okay. There now. Okay. Hi, Grandma. There's Grandma and my mom and Dylan. Hi. <laughs> That's Grandma Taylor. That's the Bramers. Two Bramers. There's our bushes that we've been trimming. And there's our prickly bush. Yeah, there's our prickly bush. There's Jeffrey and Dad playing soccer. Jeffrey! Good ball. Uh, Jeffrey's in big trouble now. The car, it just, the ball hits the grandpa's okay, car, and it turn went it under off. our car. Jeff and Brady playing soccer. This is Jeff and Barbara talking to a neighbor lady in Oklahoma, Norman, Oklahoma. Kids out playing. In the front, uh -huh. it's on. And it'll say record in here. You can see it say record. It's recording. Go. Well, and that's record. You don't, hold, don't need to hold the button. Just let it go. And it'll stay until you, then you push it again to turn it off. Smile. No, a bigger smile. No, no, wait a minute. We need a bigger smile from you in just a minute. Hurry, big smile. Say something. Say something. Okay. Hi, say hi, cousin. Down. Say hi, cousin. Hi, cousin. Hey, come here for a minute. Hurry, Johnny, come here. Johnny, I need you right here. 
Hurry. Come on. Johnny, stand up. Come on, stand up and say hello to everybody. Hello. Hello, Johnny. Take your glasses off because you're so homely. <laughs> Take your glasses off. Okay, put them on. Now you can see us. What's your name? Come on, tell everybody hello and how you love everyone. Hello. Tell them you love them all. All right, tell them you love them all. That's Texas. Hello. Did you drink this stuff? No. Then what were you doing? She's been a while. She's been a while. She's been a while. Johnny, turn this way so we can see you. Strike one. One last hit. Good grief, Johnny. Hit it. One more. Good work. That's probably enough. Say thank you for watching me. No, no, behind you, over here. Look out, Johnny. Don't be hitting with Chris around there. Chris, just stand on top of the wood pile. It's okay. Go back, Caitlin. Go, Chrissy. Go get on it. I know I get on it. He said, he said, you don't get on it. Chris, get on your own. Where's Derek at? Okay, jump off and come running. Come on, Caitlin. Caitlin, start running. Caitlin, <laughs> run and start running. Can you do that? No, Chrissy, don't do that. Can't throw it to him, Chris. Johnny, seen catch it. Catch it, Chris.
Jenny, you look unhappy. Let's see. I said talk, not see. This is Derek Ortiz. This is John and Jenny's home. Come on, Johnny. What's October 21st? Today's October 21st. Oh, yeah. 19 what? 1991. And Halloween's just... Geez, 10 more days away. Maybe 11. Yeah, 11. Okay, smile. How old are you? Eight. Eight years old? Answer biting you? Yeah? Uh oh, that's bad. This Dar's in Becky's home. Watch out for the ants, don't let them bite you. This is the back door in the back of their house. There's the barbecue there. They use that to warm up on. Hi, Chessie. What? Hi, Chessie. <laughs> you like the red car? Yeah, my car is Is it pretty? Yeah. Yours? Did you buy it? Yeah, it's ours. This is the front side of the house, their garage. That's their van in the side of the garage, Ford. Charlie's basketball court. There comes Charlie. He wants to take the car to go eat Catherine. You think I'd let him take it? Heck yeah. yeah. I want you to pay me. Tip will pay you. I got oh. no money. Drive careful, son. I will. What? I think there's no bird, Charlie. Oh, well. This is the front of their home. Charlie, Charlie's getting in the Cadillac to go get his sister. School. There's Charlie. I got him. I'll toot the horn when Kathy gets here. You can come out and videotape her, okay? Okay. In front of their home. What? This is in front of their home. There's their trampoline. Beck and Mama shooting the bull. Hi. Becky's making this uh, Mexican dinner. She made her own tortillas in there. Boy, are they good. Are they? Oh, yeah, you did eat There's a fan to keep things cool here. There's, this is their dining room. There's the fireplace that they use in the winter. There's the trophies the kids have won. There's the deep freeze. There's the back door out of the dining room. This is the kitchen. 
and make his kitchen. Did he put the new one? This is the hallway. It goes into the parlor. And they're home. A half bath. Okay, these are pictures on the wall of the family. This is the front room. Who are you? I'm Ryan. What's your name? Ryan. Who? Ryan. Ryan? Yeah. Ryan who? Whipple. Oh, Ryan Whipple. Oh, are you your mama's boy? There's a hallway going back to the be bedroom. Yeah, that's my mom. Yeah. This is Dara's and Becky's bedroom. This is their bathroom and a half. This is the bedroom. Fan going there. Big water bed. And down the hallway. And this is an extra room where they have their computer room. Computer room. That's where they do the computer work and everything else. There's JG stuff that he left here. Mine! What's your name? Tiffany! Oh, this is Tiffany's room. I thought her name was mine. That's a funny name, mine. Get out of That me. sounds German to me. Wait, wait, wait. Get away from me. I want to smoke. No! Get out of Tiffany's room, bathroom. <laughs> Pull that door that way. What? Pull the door shut. Door open. Okay. Catherine's room. Don't She's got a canopy open. over her bed. Got music. Yes. Ryan. This is Ryan's and Charlie's room. All of the kids' name is mine. Charlie. I'm being this guy for Allie. Gross, huh? Her books. I got, a, I got a huge closet here. They put all their stuff in. Are these yours, Grandpa? Okay. Sun going down. Charlie? Charlie? Charlie and Mama are watching the baseball game. Game.
Okay, come on. What are we supposed to do? And What's the name of the baby? Brennan. Brennan. Brennan what? Brennan Sean. Brennan Sean? Yeah. Ortiz? Okay, look, there you go. Turn around there. Talk to Grandpa. Talk to Grandpa now. Say hi, Leah. Say hi, Leah. You want to say hi to Leah? Say hi. Where? Say hi, Leah. Where? Because Leah's going to say hi. Just watch. say her. Say hi, Leah. Say hi, and then we'll show it to Leah. Okay? Her, say hi, Leah. Say it. Hey, Leah. Leah's going to see that. She's going to miss you. She wants you to say it. Hi, Leah. <laughs> get the baby's face where I can get it. Oh, you can't. They kind of decided to go the other way. How could there be? Why do you take him out? How could there be? There's a picture. Well, he needs to wake up. Jenny wants him to be awake. Yeah. Oh, he's so happy. 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 Oh, he's so
this is our sidewalk to this is our apartment right here right there on the bottom back of our apartment here those apartments over there is in our ward this is in our ward this open field those there and that's about it there's our trees all the kids play in the swing set and that was December the 6th it is uh, 12:30. Going down to our apartment. Going to ring the doorbell. Ding dong. Okay. Oh, number two. That's us. Okay. We go in. First thing you see is our hallway. Oh, there's Leah hiding. Stinker. <coughs> now this is our living room with our family's forever little fireplace. That. And there's Leah. We see we got Leah here. This is her uh, kindergarten picture. Family pictures. Oh, there's a young couple. I don't know who they are. And uh, there's Leah. Leah, would you like to say something? Yeah, but I don't remember. What'd you like to say? I forgot. Hi, Caitlin. I miss you. I want to go there sometime. And I want to come and visit you. She I can't see. Play with so she's you. All she can see is your chin. Say it now. Huh? Leah wants to sing her song too that she learned at school. Okay. I got turkey lolly. There's that bone in the tree. When I cut came around, I could be there. So that's why you see we're here. <laughs> Okay, this is our living room, Ernest's TV, my brother's TV, because Ernest's TV went on the blank. This is our hallway going into our kitchen area and dining area. This is your wife picking up Craig's dishes because he doesn't put them away. Oh yes, what's new? Marva Joel fixed us a wonderful lunch today. What was it? Red beets on the stuffing. stuffing. Okay. Oh, here's a temple where Marva Joel and I got married and Leah is still to us in DC Temple. Okay, now we're going down the hall. Oh, there's a thermostat. Oh, that heats the house. Oh dear. Now this is Leah's room. Leah, would you like to tell them about your room? Yeah. Okay. Show me your backpack. This is Leah's backpack for school. Boy, she's so proud to be in school. What grade are you in? Kindergarten. My name is L E A H. What's that? My name. Oh, your name. Oh, okay. Yeah, this is Leah's room here. M E L S O N. How do you spell your last name? Any else one? Oh, that's very good. Okay, well, this is your play box over here with your little well, I, things I in it. This is Nelson, I mean. Oh, yeah. Okay, and there's Leah's little table. Phone and her, her Fred number. strawberry right there. There's my phone number. What's your phone number? Seven, seven, five, three, dash, six, four, six, Zero. Good. Very good. Okay, now we're going down the hallway. This is a little hallway there. In our bathroom. Oh, that's where we go potty. Oh. <laughs> okay, that's Marma Joel's closet. That's my closet. It's nice. Have our separate closets. Alright. That's our room. There's our dirty bear, and there's me. Hi, how you guys doing? Hi. Oh, we fixed my mouth. Oh, getting fat. Oh, dear. He's a good hammer dancer, huh, Leah? You like dancing, hammer dancing? Hi. Hi. I'm Craig. This is Marva Jell. Hi, Liz and Jeff and the family, Jenny and John and family. This is Leah. Mud. Where's Jimmy? How old are you, Timmy? Eight thousand. Oh. Get out of the kitchen. Go 
Sixteen. Hey, go back, kid. I'm nine. Danny. I'm sixteen. I'm nine. Don't take pictures of me. <laughs> Jessie's smiling. She wants to be in it. <laughs> Mrs. Laurie and your family. Let me get Ginny. That's Danny. Yeah, no, I'm me. This is me. Hey, me, me. <laughs> That's the dining room. Now we're going into the. No, uh, that was the front room. We're going into the dining that's, that's room. That's the gerbils. Where's the birds? Yeah, hmm. I want to take some pictures. She's a vacuum cleaner. Well, I think we're out of film. Well, we got a tape. Nah, you still have film left in it. There's the dining room. There's the kitchen. This is Laurie's house. The fridge. On top of This is Laurie's dirty kitchen. <laughs> Some. So, this is Jesse's shoes. Did you get the angel on the top of her tree, Dad? Yes. Improper lighting. Oh. Turn it off. Dad? Yeah. Joey! What? I'm just trying to hit the angel. This is their Christmas tree, Laurie's Christmas tree. Can I see my home? This is Martha Joe, Laurie's sister. Get Sarah. Listen to the Christmas. The oldest in the, the oldest in the family. Ugliest too, the fattest too. <laughs> this is her 21st year. She's 900. I can remember when I was young. And there's the dumbest. Where'd you get this one? There's the dumbest. You didn't get Mia. Mia and Leah. That's, that post moving there is Leah. <laughs> what about me? Oh, there's, there's, there's Ginny. The oh, there's Ginny. The there's Ginny. Mm -hmm. yes, there come, the here comes Laurie. Oh, Aunt Jessie. Aunt Jessie. Turn around here so I can see her. This is Jesse. Hi, Hi. 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 Grandpa. Hi. Hi, dear. <coughs> Here comes Timmy. Now yeah, she's smiling again. Yeah. Now yeah, she's smiling. They record. Yeah. Is that little dude? Yeah. There's Timmy. Look at the cross-eyed guy there. I'm in the room. Hi. Hi. Hello. Yeah, you're on the camera, huh? Hi. This is Corey. What are you doing? 
What you got there? Get me out of it, Ernie. I'm not. You're not on it. Um, are you coming in town? What you playing with, Corey? What is it? That you. What is it? That you. Is that a plane? Is that your plane? What do you want me to open, Corey? Yes. Can't you open it? How come? You can open it. Go ahead. Oh, you can too. There, bring it to me and Daddy open. I mean, I never thought of it. Right down the road, too. Down there at the school. He'd like going down there. Mm hmm. Yeah. I don't know what you're going to pick this Corey, show me. What kind of bike is it? It's a turtle bike? Do you like riding it? No. Is it fun? Let, let me see on it. Get on it. Can you drive it? What's stuck? What do you say? What are you watching? It could be on TV, huh? Kate and Kelsey's going to be on TV, aren't you? Hold them up there, but not so high. Not above your face, there. That's the way. Tell them where you're going. Christmas. For Christmas. This one's for Lacey. This one's for Caitlin. Did Santa Claus give them to you? No, this one's for Lacey. And this one's for Caitlin. Mm -hmm. Which one's from Santa Claus? That's from Santa Claus? Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Can I see? Don't hug you. Kelsey? Hmm? Mm -hmm. Mm. Show that cute one. Hmm? Show which one? That one over there. Get it for me and you see which one you mean. That one. Go show me. Oh. Okay. Let's see your doll, okay, Caitlin. Hold your doll up, I can't see it. Uncover its head. Watch out, Kelsey. That's the way. That's the way. Move, Kelsey. Okay. Let's see. Oh, yeah. Well, that's a pretty doll. That's a Christmas doll. That's a hospital doll. That's a hospital doll. Um, Look yeah. right here. What can you see? Huh? Yeah, can you, you can see. Really? I can't, I don't move it. You've got your fingers in front of it, Joe. Where are your fingers, Grandpa? Well, he has to hold on the camera. Can you see Caitlin? Mm-hmm. See the dolly? Mm-hmm. This dolly house. Grandpa. Mm-hmm. 
I don't want you to take a picture of Grandpa. Take a picture of her. Grandpa. What? Take a picture of her. Grandpa. Okay, just, mind, just a minute. Take just a, a minute. Chinese house. Up there? Oh, okay. Get right there by your mama. Get right there by your mama. It probably hooks up to their TV. Okay. And your baby, too? Yes. We yeah. have, see, this is a talking movie, so you have to tell them what the baby is. <gasps> Come up to that baby. No. The nude baby. No. You want to mind the pictures, nude? Yes. <laughs> no. Boy, yes. Where's his diaper? Poor baby. Yep. Did you tell him what his name is? Right. Jaja. What? Guys, say hi for the camera. That's Aaron's waterbed liner. Got a hole in it, so I filled it with air. Have more fun out, fun with it that way. That's Robin's friend Priscilla. And they're out playing, having fun. It's March the seventh. Kind of got had an early spring. It's pretty warm for for around here. It feels good. There's Bubbles, our dog. There's the garage, which I had cleaned out a couple days ago, but the kids got all their bikes and stuff out of the shed, so now it's a mess again. But it's nice to have somewhere to park the cars in the winter time. There's Justin working on Justin's Pinewood Derby car. Just got it. We just sanded it and got it primed. Now we got to paint it. He did pretty good last year. Hopefully this year we designed it a little different. Maybe we'll do better. I hope. Aaron and Eric have gone up to play tennis. Today we had a birthday party for Aaron. She got a new tennis racket, so she's up trying it out. It's Aaron and her friend Liz. Practicing their tennis, I guess. Five, six, six. This is Chris. We're in our family room here. We got some new kittens. Haven't named them yet. There's one boy one and one girl one. And they're about. Oh, I think they're three or four weeks old now. This is their first day to they finally got big enough to climb out of their box and wander around. And this is their mom, Missy. She's an ugly cat. One of the kittens 
looks just like the daddy and this one looks just like Mitzi. See over here meowing. She's still kind of a nervous mother. Every once in a while she'll take one of the kittens and go hide it for some reason. We have to look through the house and find it. This is Bubbles. Bubbles, she I don't know if she thinks she's a cat too, but she gets along good with all cats. No, she doesn't, but she doesn't get along with Shadow. Well, that's true. She doesn't get along with our male cat. But that's because Shadow don't like her. October 28th, 1992. Justin won the Pinewood Derby two days ago. Had the fastest car there. Tip, tip it down so you can see the front of the car. It was the all-American racer. Most of the other cars were black and red. Didn't look the, wasn't the prettiest car there, but it was the fastest, and that's what we wanted. <laughs> <laughs> First Pinewood Derby we ever won. He got a pin there on his shirt to, to show it and for winning. Got the ribbon. Had an electronic track that kept track of all the times, electronically and everything. Now the phone's ringing, so we gotta go. 